Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening on Game Boy Color on GameCube via Game Boy Player, etc. Last time I got those fucking golden leaves, it took forever. I don't know if I spoke to this guy. I remember going here, so I wouldn't forget to speak to him though, so maybe I didn't. Ahem, <clears throat> hang on, hang on. Arsehole French, arsehole French. Ah, très bien. I see you have recovered, well I was going to do it the whole time. I see you have recovered all the leaves. Now move this box and you will find your reward. That, that seemed unnecessary. Nearly panicked and threw a bomb at that small enemy. There's actually enough time. If you don't panic and they appear under your feet, you can just walk straight over them if you've got the gall. You bitch, you little bitch. Actually, I've just read that there was no key or anything. This, this lets me into the prairie, and then the prairie gets me into the dungeon. Aha! Really, really loving this game right now. It's It's been so long that I can't really remember how to play. Well, not, not how to play. I like the specifics, so everything is just fresh enough to enjoy, but not so fresh that it's, it's a hassle. This area is lethal. There are holes everywhere. There is a, there is a school of thought that says you should not uncover all the holes. Um, I'm not following that school of thought. Let's start with going right. Son of a bitch. That's one fool already. First of many, I suspect. Mm. That classic feat. Oh, oh god, nearly fell. Nearly fucking fell there. I'm guessing I'm actually going the right way, because there's only. No. Damn it. My hubris undid me. But wait. I can do that! That's the beauty of the bushes, you see. They, they've they given you the ability to jump, which is why they have to make this maze the way they have. I suspect it becomes much easier once you get the ability to shoot fireballs, which I'm greatly looking forward to. I remember it being my favourite part of this game. Talk to me. Uh, beneath your soul. It's, it's definitely a riddle. It's not what you would call a difficult riddle. It's um, it's just, just use a shovel. <laughs> right, the slime key of Ukuku Prairie. Now the real annoying bit is I have to get back out of here. Also, notice it's playing the victory music still. Why? Legit, why? I wonder if I actually had to jump over that. Quite a big time saving, actually. Takes you miles out of your way. There's a chance there's something good if I keep going though. Actually, can I wonder if I can you might be able to pick this up, you know. There's a slim chance. Nah. I was thinking you if you you might be able to pick it up from behind, but not from the front, and it's like a little cool exit strategy. But it wasn't and I couldn't, so. I shouldn't and I shan't. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm nearly back home now. Still playing the victory music. I feel it, I feel it won't return after leaving this cave. Is it a cave or a cavern? Oh, the, the fun we could have. I don't think I've ever recorded a video this far in advance. This is about episode 6, and I don't think episode 3 or even 4 has released yet. I, I'm, I'm going on holiday shortly, so I need I need to like build a, a big surplus of videos, you see. It's, it's a long and arduous task. Right, so good news is I've opened the door. Bad news is I don't really know how to get through the door. I'm... I think I have to just walk around this prairie and I'll get there. I've now stumbled upon the best method for crossing grass. And in fact, the method I'm going to use for 
for movement from now on. It's just a lot more fun. Okay, yeah, this this is the right place. Looking at it, you'd think the item I'd get in this dungeon will be the flippers. Um, I think it. I think that is actually the case. Level three, key cavern. It's gonna be a good old-fashioned key part, isn't it? There's probably a way of opening that door, but oh, this, this one repels. I think you can kill it if you get close. Maybe not. Right, I need, I need to see if I'm getting closer each time. No, okay. Step two. I'm going to use a pot to weigh myself down. The pot disappeared and all that. Right, let's try throwing a pot at this door. Yes, that, that seems to be an odd trick that works more often than not now. I thought when I walked at these, these bombs with my shield, they would uh, they would ignite the fuse. It, it didn't work out that way then. Right or left? My instinct says go right. God, that was a good instinct. Have you ever seen more efficient killing than that? Well, yeah, obviously, but we don't talk about that time. It was a dark time in our history. Okay, remember that. I need the red blocks down to get that chest. That will likely come up later. Note the dark crystals. Fucking foolproof. I suspect killing that small pink thing will elicit a key here. Symmetry. Or symmetry, to say the word correctly. <laughs> You can always count it on Zelda, and I, I fucking hate it in other games where, where they don't have the symmetry and you're like, well there's two enemies on the left but only one on the right, what the hell. Right, I'm not sure if all of those doors were fake or I just didn't try hard enough on the first one. This is a very odd creature I'm fighting right now. It's got, it's got kind of a large beak, some big eyes, it kind of looks like a penguin. But also nothing like a penguin. I suspect killing all these enemies will drop me a key, which I need to move on. Nailed it. And this will be no. Yeah, I'm, I, I I was kind of thrown off there. I thought that would have led me back to the start, but it didn't. The floor is trying to tell me something here, but what? Note the different tone. Clearly, a bomb will do the job here. Hopefully, I'm not going to need too many bombs for this dungeon, because I've got one left, and I think they're kind of hard to come by. Okay, well, I've got one bomb left, and I need it right now. Let's hope I don't fuck... Wait, hang on, this could be a trick. Not a trick, damn it. Alright, hopefully this won't destroy the bomb I've already got. I actually forgot to change. I'm retarded. Bombs. But no, no bombs. And back. You know what? I should have known that would have led me back there. Not not the hardest thing to figure out that, was it? Nothing? Alright. I really like those body doors. I don't know why. I, I need to block some damage here. Okay, it's good to know my shield doesn't block that. I was pretty sure that would be the case. Good, another key. Body door. <laughs> Needless. It's so cool at the same time. I uh, didn't do well in that encounter. I didn't do bad, but I didn't do well. I'm now thinking that that door I just walked by, uh, that room I was just in, almost certainly on the left-hand side, there was probably a, a bomb thing, a, a space like a bomb. Sweet, more bombs. Just what I needed. This is becoming the unofficial bomb dungeon, it seems. My earlier assumption about the flippers may have been incorrect. 
Yeah, 50 rupees. There's no dicking around with different wallet sizes in this game. You, you start with, I think, the capacity for not quite a thousand, and that's just it. You just live with that. And you need them for like three or four occasions. It's just great. Okay, I, f I feel we should be able to remember to bomb that wall. By we, I mean me, and by me, I mean I, obviously. I should be able to remember. What's been going on in the world, then? That big leak in Panama. Hopefully it won't flood the canal. Uh, that's my topical joke for the day. Sweet. I love this power-up. I can feel the energy. Can you feel it? Ah, shit. Um... You need to make these eat bombs, but I don't think it's quite as easy as that. Ah, see, that's the mistake you can make. You got to, you got to really jam it down their throat. I think you can throw it, but I got a feeling there's a chance you can bounce over them. It's good to spread the damage out as well. Uh, I don't know why I thought one of them might get stronger as the other one died. Didn't happen. Right. Also, no, I got the sword power up ability immediately. Not an enemy. Oh, <laughs> Pegasus boots. That's how you break the crystals, you run through them. Now I remember everything. Prick. Right. I've got to start using some of these keys I've got. Okay, I only had two, and I kind of wasted them there because it didn't lead me to any fresh keys. I'm very turned around now. I already did both of these rooms for keys. But I, I reckon there's a secret key here. Nope. Dogs are barking heavily in the background. That can only mean intruders. Best best not to worry about these things. If I'm going to die in a home invasion scenario a la um, The Purge or Your Next or any of these films. I can't think of many. I don't watch them. Yeah, it's just going to happen. It will be on camera. And this will become a found footage film that most people will say is fake. Right. That, uh, that didn't go well. I need to figure out how to get down there. That's the, that's the, so I need to go, I need, I need to go back into the, the, the room where I got the boots. I think it's up from there, roughly. I could look at the map, obviously, but... I'm not, not really willing to do that. Could do some health. Mm, this is fine. I didn't, I didn't need need it. Just would have been nice. Right, let's look at the map. I've, I haven't got one. Yeah, I should have remembered that. I thought it was the kind of map that fills in for you, but it's not. Right. Um. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not doing overly well on health. Oh, there's different kind of bombs. Well, this will do the trick. Fuck off. Fuck right off, both of you. Come over here, now fuck off. The trouble is, the one on the bottom might have a different timer to the one on the top. It's, it worked out. Like the, the the ability to just absolutely obliterate enemies is just wonderful. Yeah, I got the compass. Great, that's completely useless, really. Oh, come on, so much text. Right, it is a bombable wall. You bet. You gotta check these things. Compass actually works like a crude map in this one, doesn't it? Wow, that that did me a right mischief. Another room? No, it was, it was unlikely. 
I'm gonna cr I'm gonna crack all these pots because I'm hopeful for some health. I'm I'm almost in the danger zone, you see. The danger zone being, you know, ah, oh, fucking outstanding. Right, let's get some run on. I'm I've got these boots and I've hardly used them. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, I said, fuck off. Kindly fuck off. Fuck off. That is so useful for fighting those. It just it just obliterates them. I didn't really read the description of the boots. I'm kind of hoping it lets me... Oh, no, I know what it is. Yeah, you combine them. You run and jump. <laughs> in in there. And what is actually quite a cool little combination. Cause I I'm not sure if it actually tells you you can do that or not. I think you just you just have to figure it out. So I'm now at the point where I've got the nightmare key. I don't have anywhere near enough keys to get to it. I'm guessing he's down there on the left. Can I? No. Let's go back down. I feel like that room with the keys is... No, oh, the first room. The first room had a chest. It's probably nothing though. All right, little, little bit tired of having that power up going. I'm not gonna lie. Right, can I go down from here? No. My mind is actually playing tricks on me. I was like, did, did that sound slightly different or not? And the answer was no, it's completely the same, but it's, it's just tricking me. Yeah, you know, thank God. Because that, that music grates after a while, doesn't it? See, I'm working on the assumption that these doors aren't real. Oh. Okay, that was entirely the wrong assumption then. Now, do, do they oscillate between positions? Roughly. Okay, well, that was somewhat effective. Gonna go for the pot zone. I need the health, damn it. I, need, I can't remember. If, I don't think this game has, like, fairies or potions or anything, or, or even bottles. I think, like, you're just on your own in terms of health. I, I just can't quite remember. Yeah, just, I panicked, is what I did there. That could be useful. I think this increases your damage. I'm not, again, I'm not really certain. Well, that didn't, that didn't work, did it? I got one of them. Haha! -ha. Okay, I'm very near to death. Fortunately, I don't think you really lose anything when you die. It's mainly just position. Son of a bitch. Ah! Oh, fucking bump me to death. Right, that is about the fifth death. I actually wanted that. Now I'm back here, I can get this wicked chest, whatever it is. I think you can kill these if you if you stab them. Yeah. Oh, this was actually incredibly important. I needed two keys. Uh, you prick. Wait, you might be able to run at this. No. It's such a... It, <laughs> I feel like that is the metric they should have measured when they made this game, is how often you have to fucking do that. Because pausing is the most annoying thing about it. Right, this... Oh, the red blocks! I had to lower the red blocks. Completely forgot about that. Um... Yeah, we still haven't actually seen any of those yet, have we? 
If that little pink thing's still dead, I can probably get a key out of this room. Can I? Nah. You bitch. So I've currently got one, and there's probably two available in that four way locked door scenario. Yay, acorn. That's, um, that's actually quite useful. I'll go up here first. So now I can definitively learn. The fact that that is blue means that blue ones are down. It didn't change colour. What the fuck does that mean then? Alright, just gotta kill these two. Alright, clear the ranks first. The key is, they work on diagonals, I believe. Right, they've, sh they've shot their loads. Right, must stop trying to go for the double hit, because you can only get one. Right, let's go for this one up top. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. I keep thinking you can kind of cheat this hole as well, and you can't. God, this is difficult. I haven't got any items that can really help me out of this, have I? Um. Hmm. Okay. That's one of the things I always forget about Zelda is... Bombs are inherently very destructive, and and that actually carries across the games. You can you can shaft them with the bombs. Also, notice that key started to fucking move. Okay, the, the way those torches were positioned kind of made me think there was something hidden there. So I need to go. I nearly panicked and died to those. Nearly happened. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back down to the, to the to wherever that room was with the thing I need. I think it's to the right of here. Nope, no hearts there. Yeah. So in here will be the final whatever it is I need, if anything. Come on, do the work for me. Oh, it's the map. I forgot that even existed. Well, I, might, I think I've got everything I actually need now. Little acorn. So I'm going to go down to the start of the dungeon. Break all the pots that are in that room. Because maybe I'll get enough hearts to survive the actual boss fight at the end. Get out of there. Actually safer to leave those bombs alive. I can't remember what the boss in this is. There's a slim chance it's some kind of centaur. Okay, nothing out of that. So it's down and then we walk through this little maze, go down some stairs. There's probably still more to the to the place than this. There's there's gotta be, isn't there? Ah, it's the thump. Oh yeah, you, the, you, I think I think this is a fucking. Oh no, I, th I thought you could just run sideways. Um, right. Yep, that did the trick. Can you just run across it? No. Nope. Right. Got to not panic here. And I, I, well, I did panic initially, but not, not too badly at the end there. One to one heart. Jesus Christ. Right, I need to wipe this place out. That's what I need to do. Oh, fuck off. Not now. Alright, got a bit of health. You know, I've got an, I've got an open playing field here. Fucking die. Yeah, I'm much faster than you realised, bitches. God, that is so nice to be able to do that. I, c I couldn't do it before, you see, because it... Jesus Christ. Another key. 
But this is the end. Why was there a key there? You can't find me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh I know where he is. He's on the ceiling. It's a big eyeball. The most tradition of Zelda bosses. You know what? Aim for the aim for the iris. I don't, is that what that's called? My toes. Oh wait, no. I just, I just I ran it apart. Yeah, that's the only time I've ever used my toes as a verb. <laughs> okay, I need to switch to um, that and learn to do that. In the time-honored video game tradition of you can you can avoid shockwaves if you jump at the right moment. Give me a heart. Give me a fairy. Come on. Ah. Oh. Oh. Shit. I was so close. Do you know what did me in, right? I think I lost my invincibility. Um, when I... There was a point when I fell. That when it fell on me, I paused it. And I got hit twice when I shouldn't have. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Basically, it was a game-ending glitch. Um, just had some panic we weren't recording. It's been a long one today. I should I should have done the prayer at the end of the last episode, but I was I was I was pissed off. You know you know what you're doing when when your setup doesn't involve the sword. Time it just right. Can I kill this? Maybe. Yes. Hmm. It's good to know. See in Mario that then they're, they're next to unkillable. You just don't expect to ever be able to do it. But in this fucking. Fucking A. Just go at him. Alright, kill this one. Ooh. Crystal is actually working to my advantage there. Full health. Perfect. Quite a bit of cash. I also just saw that bamboo rod in my inventory. I'm guessing it gives you the key there, because if if you use the small keys in the wrong order, you can get here, but you won't have the boss key, and the boss key is behind a locked door. But then, I've got one spare. There's not, there's not a room I haven't been in either. Ah, it's, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe there's maybe there is just legit legit one spare key. Right. Knock him down. Should jump for that. Right, split them. Split them more. Might totalize them. Now switch to this. Right, I didn't time that very well. It's just after the music is when you gotta do it. Uh, no, that's not true. It's actually easier just to keep jumping, I've decided. <laughs> it's about perfect for a double jump. Right. It wasn't even hard. That's the bit that annoyed me. I just I just dicked around too much the first time. It's not like it took long either. It was about 30 seconds of recovery. Look. The, it's a bell. Let's call it the Siren Bell. Could be the name. The Sea Lily's Bell. Oh, so close. That actually sounds like... I'm, I bet you, right, Little Easter Egg, that's the name of the ship that he's, he, he crashed, he wrecks on at the start. That's my guess. The Sea Lily. No, it's probably just called the Zelda, wasn't it? Waterfall? It is hidden in the Waterfall? A couple of things. I haven't yet seen a waterfall, so there's that. Um, well, that'll be for next time, figuring out where this waterfall is. I'll see you then. Thanks for watching.